Hello everyone and welcome back to Wonderland and welcome to Sydney's Light Rail and here we are at the fish market stop. Sydney's Light Rail, also known as the Inner West Light Rail, is a modern and convenient mode of transportation that connects Central Station in the heart of Sydney to the suburb of Dulwich Hill. The light rail plays a significant role in the city's public transport network, offering a seamless, sometimes, and efficient, sometimes, travel option for both commuters and tourists. The light rail vehicles are air conditioned, wheelchair accessible, and equipped with real-time information displays to keep passengers informed about upcoming stops and connections. The light rail operates at regular intervals, ensuring minimum wait times and providing a reliable transportation option for both daily commuters and visitors. Today we're only going a couple of stops from Fish Market to Jubilee Park, but you do need an Opal card or your credit card connected to your Opal account because it is a paid service. Trust me, you do not want to find for fair evading. So here we are at our location, the tram sheds. Join me for a walk through. The tram sheds have a fascinating history that reflects their transformation from derelict structures covered in graffiti to vibrant hubs of culinary delight. Originally built in 1904, the tram shed served as a depot for Sydney's extensive tram network, housing trams and facilitating maintenance and repairs. Over time, trams became less popular and were phased out. The tram sheds fell into disuse and were abandoned. Neglected and left to decay, they became a canvas for graffiti artists and street art enthusiasts which I actually liked. The once grand and bustling facility was reduced to a dilapidated state, for some. However, in recent years, the tram sheds underwent a remarkable revitalisation. The abandoned shells were transformed into a vibrant and bustling precinct that now boasts a diverse range of restaurants, eateries and shops. The restoration project aimed to preserve the historical character of the tram sheds while infusing it with new life and purpose. Today, the visitors to the tram sheds can explore a culinary wonderland. The spacious halls and original features have been carefully preserved, creating a unique ambience. The interior is now filled with an array of dining options, ranging from cafes and bakeries to trendy bars and fine dining establishments. It has become a food lover's paradise where visitors can indulge in a variety of cuisines from around the world. The transformation of the tram sheds reflects the power of adaptive reuse and community-driven initiatives. What was once a symbol of neglect and abandonment has now become a thriving destination, drawing locals and tourists alike to the experience of its culinary offerings, historical charm and vibrant atmosphere. I did visit the tram sheds quite early, so they weren't as busy as they sometimes are, but one of my favourite places to go is Osaka Trading Co. It is a renowned restaurant nestled in the tram sheds, inspired by the vibrant culinary scene of Osaka, Japan. This restaurant offers unique dining experience that combines traditional Japanese flavours with a modern twist. As you step in, you'll be greeted by a warm and inviting atmosphere. The interior design seamlessly blends contemporary elements with traditional Japanese aesthetics, creating a harmonious and visually appealing space. Let's talk about the food. Osaka Trading Company is known for its extensive menu that showcases a wide variety of Japanese dishes, from sushi and sashimi to ramen, to name just a few. The talented chefs at Osaka Trading Co. take a great pride in using fresh, high-quality ingredients to create dishes that are not only visually stunning, but also bursting with flavour. The tram sheds has something for everyone. Experience the art of Asian fusion where traditional ingredients are harmoniously blended with modern culinary techniques to create flavorful dishes. Embark on a Mediterranean feast, savoring the vibrant colors and robust flavors of the region through an array of metzi plates, grilled delicacies, and fresh seafood. For those seeking comfort and familiarity, find solace in cosy cafes offering freshly brewed coffee, artisanal sandwiches and delectable pastries. From aromatic espressi to velvety lattes, these cafes provide a relaxing space to unwind and savour the simple pleasures of good food and great company. But of course, we can't go anywhere without going to Messina, my favourite gelato. Messina prides itself on using the finest ingredients, sourcing fresh fruits, premium chocolates and other high quality components to craft their creamy delights. 
With a commitment to creativity and flavour experimentation, Messina's constantly pushes the boundaries of traditional gelato offerings, including unique and exciting combinations. Thank you for joining me on the quick walkthrough of the tram sheds. I hope you'd enjoyed some of the diverse culinary offerings on show today. But don't forget to join me next time by clicking that subscribe button and giving me a like. And we'll see you again soon in Wonderland.